I think I'm in the middle of Tokyo right now. Uh, I'm a total stranger here. If you are thrown in the middle of Tokyo with no money and no phone, then what would you do? In Tokyo, we have an extremely convenient transportation system and it is that super convenient city. But if you are a visitor in Japan, that's a different story. Too many stations, too many tall buildings. So I thought even for Japanese people, if they are thrown right in the middle of Tokyo, they will struggle as well. But these guys, who love to travel, who love to challenge, said, Without money and a phone, that's too easy. So, I came up with an experiment if it's possible for them to get to the destination without phone and money throwing them off somewhere they have never been. So today, we were supposed to go to the museum. I changed the plan. So what we're gonna do is I brought two towels here. First of all, I will pick them up. And when I pick them up, I will cover their eyes with towels like this. And I will take somewhere in Tokyo. And then they have to walk to some certain place that I selected. No money, no phone. And then let's see who's faster. So let's go. Good morning. Hey, yo. Let's go. We to Labo. Right? Yeah. You're thinking we gotta go to Labo, right? Yeah. Actually, yeah. we're doing different things today. We will challenge you guys and I will drop off you guys in somewhere in Tokyo and I will set a goal. So you have to walk there with no ah. money and no phone, okay? What? <laughs> you have to compete and whoever loses have penalty. So you have to like go faster and faster, okay? So now we are here to drop Gaku. So, let's do it. So this is nowhere in Tokyo, so I think he will get confused. Goku! Wait! Come up, come out. What? Okay, he'll like die in here. Take off. So here we are. <laughs> here what? we are. Like, any clue here? No, right? Of course not. This card has the destination written on, so here you are. And give me the phone. Okay? Okay. Yeah. Alright, where's the destination? Mariage Freire, Ginza Honten. What the fuck? See you at there. <laughs> okay, let's go. <laughs> <laughs> no. Like, I have no clue here. Okay, I'll give it a try. Phones, yeah. wallet. Enjoy! Amiga. Uh, so now. <laughs> I think I'm in the middle of Tokyo right now, but I had to head to Ginza first. Ah, uh, shit. Okay, so I have no clue where this is. Actually, um, the place I always spend most of the time is around my house, so I have no clue. Okay, let's go then. Okay, right now, I just found out that this place is called Higashiazabu Dainara. So my strategy is to like go to a big road and head where the like tall buildings are because Ginza has all the tall buildings. Okay, guess what? I just got to this big road and it started to rain, I guess. Shit. Looks like I had to head to... That way, I guess. On the top, it says Kibiya Dori Avenue. I'm pretty sure that Kibiya is right near Ginza. So, I guess we're heading the right way. You know what? This game is too easy for me. Well, you know, I always use Google Map to walk around. The rain is getting stronger. But I think we, I need to strategize for this, right? I'm heading to um, area where I can see tall buildings. Wait, can you see that? It's raining. Oh my god, this is so weird. Environment. Okay, so let's check out where we are right now. So what I can see is, look at that. Showa Dori. I have no clue where that is. Oh, look at that. Can you see that? The green one. It is saying Ginza is that way. Haha, <laughs> it's easy.
I'm bored in the house, I'm in a house board. Bored in the house, I'm in a house board. <laughs> So I'm gonna just have to go straight down this road and eventually I will hit Hibiya. And if I can go to Hibiya, Ginza is like right near. So going to Ginza was the easy game. But I guess the difficult point is that I have to go to the cafe. That guy just like gave me a paper and gave the name of it. Um, guess what? I lost the paper. But I guess the name was uh, Maria Ju Cafe. So I have to walk around and ask people about that when I get to Ginza. So now that we're at Ginza, so I've been walking like 30 minutes now and <laughs> I have no clue where I am right now. Well, I think I'm a bit lost right now. Gins is supposed to have a lot of tall buildings, but I, what I see is only like not tall buildings. It's like I'm sort of a residential area. Wait, look at that. It is saying Ginza, but it's totally not Ginza. Wait, am I close? Oh, wait, wait, wait. I think I'm here. I am here. I'm Ginza. Look at that. But I need to go here. Oh, so I'm gonna start asking people. Look at that. There is a samurai standing still. So, this is the destination. And now I'm gonna wait Yusuke and Gaku here. There's one guy who came here. So, the champion is. Thank you. Congratulations. So it's been a while. And what's going on? Like I arrived like 40 minutes ago. Really? Yeah. Your penalty is to shave your leg hair. Really? But, like, we don't shave. We just gonna shave it. Right? <laughs> How was it? It was a little bit difficult. It was a really good experience for me. Yeah. I always spend most of the time in like a specific place, but this time I kind of explored a different area of Tokyo. Yeah. So yeah it was good and thank you.